So he fed them according to the integrity of his heart and guided them by skillfulness of his hands. Psalm 78, 72 Dear Lord, I know that there is no replacement for integrity. No false humility or manufactured words could ever replace pure intentions. I pray that you would give me a pure heart, O Lord, and set my gaze upward toward you. I want to be a person of honor, always matching my actions with my convictions. I know this is truly impossible without your guidance, power, and comfort. So, I pray your spirit would give me all these things and more for your name's sake. Make me more like you every day, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks for making prayer a priority in your life. Follow this podcast and listen weekly to receive godly wisdom and practical advice for daily living. Again, our goal for today's meditative prayer is all about stoic leadership. So right now, let's just take a moment to hide away in your secret place. Maybe a place where you can be by yourself and be at ease. A place where you can turn off all distraction. And right now, breathe in deep through your nose and exhale out through your mouth. And reach out to God, preparing to let His words fill your heart. Today we'll be meditating on Psalm 78, 72 from the King James Version. It says, So He fed them according to the integrity of His heart and guided them by the skillfulness of His hands. Right now, let's just take a moment to pour out your adoration to God. Lord, I praise you for your word is upright and eternal. Your ways are perfect and all your works are done in faithfulness. I extol you for you are a God of fidelity and consistency. You are without iniquity, just and righteous in all your ways. Leadership requires integrity and integrity comes from within. It is conceived in the heart through righteous choices and nurtured by godly actions. That is why strong leadership is born out of integrity of the heart. This can seem discouraging as no one is perfect, nor do we act perfectly all the time. However, God does not have need of perfection. Instead, he asks for honesty. Honesty in your thoughts, decisions, and behavior. You see, to achieve this, you must rely on the Holy Spirit and heed his guidance. You must also be honest, above all, with yourself and with God. Godly leaders recognize points of correction not only in others, but within the self as well. They do not apply partiality to themselves, nor make excuses for bad behavior. King David, attributed with being a man after God's own heart, is an amazing example of this. He definitely was not perfect, and he committed grievous errors. But he also acknowledged his sins and made amends for his mistakes. This is hard, but you must remember integrity requires continuous effort. God knows and he understands this, my friends. So take this time to cleanse your soul and confess your lack of honesty to God. Now, as we transition, let's just think for a minute on all the blessings God bestows through honesty. Think of the outcomes Jesus has promised to those who act justly. All the blessings, the joy and prosperity that righteousness brings. Think of past situations where honesty was a challenge for you, but you persevered. Thank God for the growth and learning that came from those experiences. And thank Jesus for all his glory manifested in your life through righteousness. My friends, God is present and he is listening to you. So be mindful that integrity is a necessity and a blessing. 
God never said honesty would come easily, but he promised to help you every step of the way. He sent the Holy Spirit to enable you to succeed. So ask the Holy Spirit to increase your love for righteousness. Ask him to make you more like Jesus. Ask him to empower you to live an honest life the way Jesus did. Remember, God has called you to lead with a pure heart, to cultivate and nurture integrity as a part of who you are. God has great tasks for you to accomplish, and he expects that you will do so with an honest heart. So be confident in the Lord's righteousness. Love others through just actions and in truth. And do this, and you will see God's grace manifested in and throughout your life. The podcast is a moving and inspiring biblical audio experience that will help you master wisdom from the world's greatest book. In each episode, you'll learn to apply biblical principles to everyday life. Each cinematic episode is a journey through the Bible's most profound stories that will strengthen your appreciation of the Word and inspire you to keep learning.